What is up guys? Today I work on the One Tire Fryer go-kart and it's a roller. Enjoy the video. Okay, so now I am going to assemble the drive wheel. I took it apart a while ago. I didn't I didn't film it. But uh, I found all sorts of garbage in the wheel. I found out that there's water in them. There's water in both rear tires. And I found out that the previous owner stacked a lot of washers to get the to get the sprocket the correct distance from the wheel. Because when it's just sitting in there, it's just sitting in there. There's no way for there's no way to put a chain on it. So for now I'm gonna start stacking washers because I don't have any other bare solutions right now. Actually, I better blast it first. And I should probably get this out of the way. It's just in my pocket. Making progress. See which ones are stuck. Wow, that's really stuck in there. Well, that's the first time that's ever been off since I owned it. That's a. I don't know if you can see it, but that is one aligned sprocket. I okay, so it's another day out today, and I'm going to work on the go kart a little bit. And all I'm, go all I'm gonna be doing today is here, I'm getting the I'm getting the tarp off real quick. What I am going to do today is I am going to see if I can make this thing into a rolling chassis. The only thing that's stopping me from that is that wheel bearing. It's I don't like to get up here. That's the problem. I uh, I was working on it a while ago, and I don't have the footage from it. But I was working on it. 
and I pried that, I pried that, that wheel off, and the, the bearing came out, the bearing came out of the hub, instead of coming off the spindle, it's frozen on there. It's been sitting with blaster on it, P-blaster on it, for a long time now. I'm hoping it'll work. So, I've got, got some three-jaw pullers and some good stuff, and I'm going to see if I can get it off. Okay, first, okay, so I'm going to hit it with some more blaster just in case, and I'm just going to see what it'll do, yeah, it's still very frozen on there, so, let's see what we can do here, I hope this, I hope these pullers will be long enough for the spindle, if not, that's a pickle. Hmm. I'm seeing some movement. Oh, it's coming. Slowly. Scoot it back and forth. It's coming! Yes! Yeah, the three jaw pullers, they're not long enough. Gross. Oh. That's a great improvement on before. The first time I was working on it, it would not move at all. Haha, -ha, there we go. That doesn't feel or sound good, but I'm just going to put it right back in to the wheel. I don't really care about this bearing, that's why I'm not being very careful with it. I couldn't really care less if I broke it, because this is a, most of the bearings on this cart are bad. But I'm just gonna roll with it. I'm trying to get it going in time in time for Pate Swap Me. I'm going to be there on the twenty seventh at Texas Motor Speedway. And I'm gonna be hanging with a lot of other YouTubers like Cars and cameras and Red Beer's garage and all that good stuff. And I'm really looking forward to that. So I'm just trying to get this thing running in time for all that because I want to be able to drive around the swap meet and also I want to see if I can pick up some parts for it while I'm there. I am I'm gonna just get this thing barely running, stick a cushion on there for a seat because I want to be really open to ideas. I, I, I might I might turn this into some really awesome creation. I don't know. We'll see. Ooh, those threads are gross. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. So, so at this point, the starter came put together wrong. It, I don't know how the starter even worked, but it did. So, I've got new starter parts coming, and once they come, I'll, I'll go ahead and put that in, any, in another video, and hopefully it'll be a runner by the next video. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Oh, yeah, one more thing before I forget. Um, check out the DIY Go-Karts forum. It's uh, my, my project, the One Tire Fryer, is on, is on there. It's, under, it's in the build-off competition, actually under the thread Ultimate Yard Cart. So check it out. You'll find some updates there that I might not talk about on here. I don't know. 
and um, so yeah, you can go there for updates. You can you can sign up. You can sign up for make an account, and you can um, start threads. You can ask questions. The community there is really great. They've they're really helpful. They know a ton, and the moderators especially. The moderators are really good. So yeah, go ahead and sign up for that forum, and you can. I'm under the the username JT Speed Demon on there. All no spaces, no spaces. And yeah, see you later. <laughs>